We had a cooking class, Dutch oven cooking class over at Fireman's Park, and the reason why they held it here today was in order to um, incorporate Farmer's Market. They went over and they bought vegetables, they bought turnips, and they bought mushrooms, and they bought, actually they also incorporated the meat to make the stew, which was delicious. They had the green peppers, onions, and um, we had a wonderful dessert. So that part did not come from the farmer's market, but the rest of it was all incorporating the farmer's market and to bring awareness to um, home goods, I guess is what you would call people who um, grow vegetables and have their own feed, um, was it grass-fed cows so that they can have the meat, and the meat was very tender and very delicious. Now when I get ready to start this meat, I'm basically gonna be doing a frying process, so I'm not gonna to be too worried about having too much heat. The class was wonderful. It was very informative. The man took his time and spent time with us and really showed us and instructed us exactly how to do things, where to buy the equipment, how to, how to use it properly, how to clean it. Um, he was very, very informative on, on cooking, and it was, it encouraged you to go home and want to do everything, so um, it was well worth being here this morning. I have done, I have done Dutch oven cooking, and I've only done pan de campo, and I've also done a dessert, but now I know that I can branch out and do stew, and he also said that you could, you know, somehow or another you could adventure into rice, but the vegetables were very tender and well cooked. And I also learned that you have to use so many bricks, brickets of charcoal because you just don't pile them all on. <laughs> so again, it was informative. And the man did a great job in teaching. It's very good. It's very good. <laughs> this saw is really good. Oh yeah.